Hey guys, welcome back to another double unboxing video. We're unboxing two animatronics in one video. It seems to be a hit. You guys love it when we do side-by-side -side comparisons of two animatronics, so we're gonna do it again. And don't forget, guys, to smash that subscribe. We've been opening Halloween, Spirit Halloween, gifts all season long and we've gotten a bunch of doubles we're gonna actually show them to you right now and we're going to box them up and send them to one of our subscribers so make sure you smash that subscribe because we're gonna do a doubles giveaway of all the doubles we got this season and we're gonna pull a winner one of our subscribers guys why don't you show them some of the doubles we got so first we got the foot pen so we got a zombie pen which is so cool and where's the book that we're also gonna to give them. So this is gonna go in the box. So here's our box right here. We're actually gonna start packing things up. So that's going in the box. Then the, the uh, Sam sitting on a pumpkin. And he lights up. We, had, we have two of him, so we're gonna give him away. He lights up. And what else, Carlo? This we got Gently the put him. We're gonna wrap him with bubble wrap this so he doesn't break. We got the Sam unmet snow globe with Sam. We window. got a Sam snow we're globe. Gonna we're gonna put him in bubble wrap too, but we're starting to pack up a box that we're gonna give away. And then there's one other or two other doubles we got. Carla, what's that one? Next we got the light up Sam. Yep, we already had him and we got a double of him for Christmas. So we're packing him up. Why don't you show them how he lights up, Carla? Oh, it's in day, so you can't see him. Oh, yeah, maybe it's day. maybe it's hard to see, but but he lights up, and we have them. It's very and they're hard. Really cool. See him in there. And Put him in the box. The Sam rules of Halloween. Right, and this will be it's good with the creepy pen that we also added in there. So we're at, we're at, just putting a bunch of the stuff in the box, and look for our doubles giveaway video because we're going to be sending this box to one of our subscribers. So make sure you smash that subscribe. Boo 365, where it's Halloween all year long. <laughs> hey guys, what's your channel? In today's, we're going to be doing two for one unboxing video. Right, guys. So, in this video, we are unboxing the Spirit Halloween Rat Girl and the Spirit Halloween Spike with our which are both right now on a pretty good sale on the Spirit Halloween website. The boys got them for Christmas and we are excited to do another double unboxing video. They look like they have the same box. Yeah, they're this around the same size, around the same price. So we thought, let's put them side by side up against each other. So Carlo, who do you think is gonna win the competition? Spike because he has no legs and he's hanging. Okay. Junior, who do you think is going to win the battle? Brat girl. Brat girl. Okay, let's take a better look at their boxes. Oh my gosh. We were reading the backstories on them and we noticed something wild with Spike. So, Junior, can you tell us what we noticed, which is kind of crazy on Spike's box? So, on the backstory, it says that Spike's uh, got been by... That man's best friend. And we know. Wait, wait, an undead. Undead man's best friend. So, and Bubba is man's possessed best friend. That's a, a dead, a, the undead zombie dog. So, Spike might be Bubba's owner. Right, so we think Spike might be the owner of man's possessed friend Bubba because it says right here. Where does it say it? Right here. Right here. Where? Why don't I see it? Oh, right here. Okay. Uh, he ended up getting bitten by an undead version of man's best friend. So we think that Bubba, the zombie dog, could possibly belong to Spike. Let us know in the comments if you think we're crazy or if you think we're on to something. All right. So Rat Girl from Spirit Halloween swings back and forth for a spooky effect. Eyes move as she swings and hums. That is creepy. Hangs six feet, one inch tall. And now here we are with Spike. Torso moves back and forth. Light up LED eyes. 
and agonizing groaning stands at or hangs at three feet two inches tall all right guys let's pop them open and see what we have going on Whoa. oh they're both slide out boxes so we have to lay them down I think spikes, spikes boxes slide it out oh i see legs i see clothes what do we see over here oh i see hands three feet please oh. mommy die Oh my! Feliz Navidad! Feliz Navidad! It's Feliz Navidad! You are crazy! Let me see his head! You see, pass him over! Of course, Carla's gonna pick the nose like before passing him over. Well, of course he's crying. His wife got a stake in his head. Wouldn't you be crying too? Look at this. He has the stake in his head. Look at his mouth and these terrifying eyes. Oh! Yeah, My like, goodness. It's like poking out. It's like right yeah, there. you think it's poking out? You think it's about to poke out? Yeah. Really cool. Here are the hands and the clothes. Oh, and here's he everything it. that it comes with. Where's the other hand? Hello, other hand. Oh my gosh, it's bitten off. I bet your Bubba bit it off. Really awesome. This looks like it's going to be a quick and easy build. Oh, now let's check out rat Spike rat Girl. Rat oh, rat I said Spike Girl. Rat Girl. Comes with a rat. Oh my goodness, a hanging little rat and her feet. Where's her head? Mm -hmm. Oh, it's in the box. Pop open the box. Let's just check out her head. Oh, buddy, we need for yes, we need some scissors. Here is her cute little purple dress with the little collar. It reminds me of um who's that other girl? No, who's the other girl uh with the pigtails that reminds us of Wednesday? Oh, Menacing, Molly. Menacing Molly. Yes, because she had like a little collar uh, dress as well. And I think she might have even had some buttons. She kind of reminds me of Betty Sharp. Oh, yes. She, I can see. Dead. Yeah, she, I can see I it. Why. All right, Junior got it open. Oh, my gosh. Oh, of course, Carla's going to pick the oh, nose. Oh, I think she has a dent in her head. Is her cheek dented? Let me see. Bring her here. Oh, yeah. I think she's a little dented. Oh, no. Ours is dented. Poor girl. And she has like a yellow mark on her head. What the heck? And there's like a yellow marker on her head and her nose. Wait, where did you And get she box? has two dents. One here and one here. And it looks like she has some type of yellow marker on her nose. But, all right. We'll try to play around well, with it and see it if we could fun. pop it back out. But let's get this girl together. Look at these creepy eyes. We'll oh my goodness. And she has these little we'll pigtails. Oh my gosh. And here is her creepy bloody friend, which is a gross rat. And she likes to collect these things. So they are creepy looking. All right, we're popping open. What is that like part of the mechanism? Pretty cool. And. Ooh. Let's see. So this is everything that Rat Girl comes oh, this with. Is how she swings. Oh yes. And then this is everything that Spike comes with. And do he you has guys? A rope. Oh yes, he has a rope to hold him up. Are you guys ready to do this? Yeah. Say let's do it. Let's do it. the rat girl together and the spike together we're going to show you rat girl first so you have to hang her with this mechanism right here but we don't have anything that this could like uh hold on to right now so we're just going to have her in the sitting position just so we could show you what she looks like but oh my gosh is she going to be creepy on halloween when she's actually hanging and let's give you a quick demo thank my Three blind mice. See how they run. Not fast enough for me.
gosh, she is terrifying. And she's going to be even creepier when she's swinging. This is the mechanism. It, it uh, makes the swing swing. But right now, like I said, we just have her in the sitting position. And she is still terrifying. Look at how her eyes move back and forth. It's so scary. And here's Mike. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> He is loud and heavy. Why don't you give him to Junior? Junior, why don't you take him? Because you're a little taller. Hold him up. He is so creepy. And he comes with the rope that you could hang him. We're going to probably hang him in a tree or something next year. But look how crazy it is. We got Junior holding him up. He is totally insane and terrifying. Oh my gosh, let's look at him one more time. <laughs> All right, guys, so that was the Spirit Halloween Spike versus the Spirit Halloween Rat Girl. So, Junior, who do you think wins the battle? Is it the Spike or is it the Rat Girl? So, Rat Girl is more creepier, but and Spike is a little more like 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 cooler. Like moves around, like you like the way he moves around. So, who do you think though? If you had to choose one, if it was only one, who would win this competition? Rat Girl. Rat Girl. Okay, Carlo, who do you think wins the battle? Is it Spike or Rat Girl? You spike, of course. You guys always go for your own animatronics. All right, so we have a one-to-one. -one. So we want to know what our viewers think. Comment down below who is your favorite and who you think wins this battle. Is it the Spirit Halloween Spike or the Spirit Halloween Rat Girl? Let us know who you think the winner of this battle is. But until the next video, what do we say, guys? Keep it spooky, guys. Keep it spooky. And we'll see you in the next video. And hit that subscribe. Merry Christmas. Smash that subscribe. Join our spooky crew. Thanks for watching. Make sure you give us a thumbs up and hit the button to subscribe. Click one of these to see more Spook 365.